Hey, this is J.S. Neko here, and we are going to be playing uh, Reset here on J.S. Neko Plays JRPGs. I was playing Renaissance of Fate, but I realized that the setup that I had was really, you know, thrown together. So until I get something more appropriate, I was going to put Renaissance on Fate on hold, and then play something else. And luckily for me, I was able to get a new laptop that has, you know, reasonably good hardware. So I figured, well then, let me just, you know, do some let's plays of computers that I have on my PC. So, as you can see here, this is Reset here. And essentially, it is a, a JRPG, but not in the tra traditional sense. Because instead of playing the role of an adventurer, primarily, you're primarily playing the role of a little girl who runs an item shop in the town. So you essentially need to, you know, run an item shop and you need to collect items buy items or you need to hire adventurers to go collect items for you so that you can sell in your shop because that's part like I'm not gonna spoil it for you but because you find out really quickly but you know it's a, it's a really fun game it has a cult following and you know I guess I'm part of that cult because I really do love the game I haven't finished it before but hopefully with this last play we'll be able to finish it now so with further ado, without further ado, we're going to jump right into this. What? Yo, what kind of, like, what kind of mumbling is that? You know, to have in your sleep. Mimble work. Like, really? She said, wake up! Get up! It's time. Yo, I've, I've got to, I've got to, I have got to give props to, uh, guys who localize this because they have a superb script well not really but this is not bad oh, but they can, they can, oops uh the script can get pretty wacky at times we do not have time for a good morning Rossetti. I mean, honestly, I can't blame her. I love sweets too, so I definitely dream. I definitely do dream of sweets every now and then. But it's like, well, not every now and then, more like once in a blue moon. Still, there's nothing wrong with that. She already is presentable. Y'all don't change clothes at all in this world. Fun fact, Wakata means I un is another way of saying I understand. Aww, she's so, she's so kawaii. Aww. And that, that, ladies and gentlemen, is like the catchphrase of this whole entire game. Capitalism ho! Tutorial. That's right, this is the tutorial. Wow! Alright. Uh, I don't know, get some shit to sell? Maybe, get some shit to sell sounds like a pretty good idea, but maybe that's just me. Because, you know, I have never run a shop before, so I don't know. Hey! I was right. So this me. Well, see, you can visit the shop, 
you can visit like the merchant skills or go into town to buy items in order to resell them at a higher value but the profit and the margin that you get for these items is significantly smaller than if you just hire an adventurer just to go out into the wild and you know collect items it's just that when you go out into the wild with an adventurer there's a chance that you can you know die and lose all your items and you all you did was just waste time to say gravel. Got a bunch of people just walking out in front of the windows, so the needle is gonna get glass all over the place, and then people are gonna be stepping in glass. It's gonna be a mess. Oh wow! Hi. She sounds so depressed. Shots fired. And she's not even really denying it. Well, if you are a lone shark, you are a lone shark. I mean, come on now. That's right, mister. She's my partner. Oh, I was right. What the hell? Trust me, I wasn't even trying. I, I don't remember. I don't remember the script like that. so responsible oh wait that was tear talking Yeah, let's get some shit. Let's buy 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 some shit. Let's let's buy. Let's 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 buy some shit. Let's let's buy some. Let's let's buy some shit. Shit shit. Let's buy some shit. Let's buy some. Let's buy some shit. know about this all this but I hate having the new I just hate having the little like new word a little icon above it just letting me know that you haven't read it yet
items. Now I'm gonna sell some shit. <laughs> sell some shit. Yes. It's time to open up our store. You're going to create the greatest store. We're gonna become the next Walmart. We are going to be a, a, a monopoly. We're just gonna monopolize all over these guys. We're just gonna be like, you all are going to have to buy here because our prices are so insane that if you buy anywhere else, people will think you're crazy. We're gonna be like that. I'm gonna be balling. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be like Scrooge McDuck, just swimming in money, just money, ah, money all over the place. Walnut bread? That doesn't sound too bad. Capitalism! Oh! Well, okay, so basically, if you guys don't know, I'm not sure how. S I'm not sure when they'll go over it. <coughs> but if you don't know, the premise of the story is that Resetia has a father who ran the item shop. But all of the, out of the blue, he decided to well actually no I said I wouldn't I said I wouldn't spoil it oh god no I don't want to do a crash course all right now I'm skipping that I mean, on, honestly, the tutorial was just telling you how to run the shop, and that's a lot of stuff that I just did not want to go over, because this is like my third or fourth time restarting this game. Yes, I know. Like, you put shit, you put shit in these four spaces in front of the window, and that makes it more likely for people to see it and come in. So if you can put some real shiny stuff there, real expensive stuff, it makes your shop look that much more appealing and more people will come in. That's, that's all that she's saying. She's so cute. Oh yeah, that's how much money I have to pay by next week. So if I don't, pretty much I have to start all over again. And it really sucks because you lose all your relationship. You lose all of it. Like everything that, every, most of everything that you work up to build, you lose. And it gets really annoying when you have like an adventurer that you're attached to, and then it's just like you die. And I, I have to put everything down there. <laughs> yep, I had to put everything down there. I wanted to keep the bread because the bread is health and I need that for my adventures. But yeah, like I was saying, when you die because you can't uh, complete the payment, essentially what happens is that the whole entire thing that you just did turns out to be a dream and you start back on day one. So all the relationships and all the adventures and characters that you meet and build up relationships with, that all goes back to zero. I think like the only thing that you keep is your merchant level, and which makes it easier for you to make money starting all over again but the whole fact is you gotta start over and that can get really annoying I know how to sell things thank you very much because you just pretty much sit here and you just wait for people to come in and when they want to buy an item you have to like it's not just like a set item but it's a it's a suggestive price you know kind of like uh, OBO or or best offer for like cars so like let's say I wanted like 20 picks for this one item right they're gonna say well maybe can you sell it to it well maybe like they're gonna like uh, you'll see yep cancel it <laughs> Oh, well, I think, like, pretty much you have to suggest, suggest a price higher, or suggest your own personal price for each individual item, and they say if they want it or if they don't want it. If they don't want it, you have to lower the price into a range where they'll be willing to buy, and if they do want it, they'll buy it, and then you get the money.
お店開けますね。なあ、it's definitely a sign. Alright, so as you level up your merchant level, you get extra things to do with your shop. Like, eventually, you'll be able to like, open up vending machines, you'll be able to change the floor tiles, like the walls, and like a whole bunch of stuff about your store. You'll be able to, you know, change and adjust, and you'll gain extra abilities as a merchant, which it helps you sell more. Sounds like such an airhead. I, me, Rossetti, I sold stuff, like, to people. Ah. Oh. Voice actors keep that high pitched voice like for so long. Learn to love this music because you will totally be hearing it a lot. I like the outfits. I mean, okay, her、uh, Rossetti's outfit kind of makes sense considering she's a merchant, so she needs pockets. Though, not so much、uh, uh, tear. Yeah, serious, like, this just blows my mind. He just up and left and be like, I want to be a hero! And then just dipped, leaving his only daughter, no mother, in the, in the item shop that he owns. Just bam, just like, what? Why? Like, how irresponsible. Like, how like, if this was America, child social services would have already would have taken her away within like a week. Easily. No doubt. And she's not even mad. Like, how young are you? She's not even mad that your father just up, or just up and left. If that was me, I, I'd be like. That's not the point. What about you? Stop being so selfless. That's like a shitty way to introduce yourself. Like, excuse me, I am the one asking the questions. Are you Resetir Lemongrass? I, I could just, if, I could just feel her neck just pivot left and right as her head just bobs. She just rudely dismisses anything that she says. Father just dipped because he was like, Oh, oh, I'm not paying this loan. 
Fuck everyone. Like, honestly, she's like a little kid. How do you expect her to understand any of this? She's not an adult. Oops. She's struggling. She is struggling to understand the whole tight situation. finance company is just gonna be like well since your father's not here you being a little kid's gotta have to take have to pick up his slack so you better get to work girl what why <laughs> like what finance company does that i don't even that shouldn't be legal at all but this is not my world i'm surprised you even have money in the first place to be honest into your mind. Labor, she says. Ha ha ha. Oh, wait, you already know what she's gonna do. Oh, there goes that joke. That joke and really poor joke. I think I might turn down the music a bit. Then it all began.
Oh, there she goes, being adorable. Yeah! Look at me hammer that song three times! Honestly, can I mean, hey, how the world? How am I supposed to know where to go if you don't have a sign? It's just like you're just gonna be like, hey, let's go to that place. It's got that sword that I want. What place are you talking about? You know that place that's on the main street with the girl running the shop. Oh, what's the name of that place? It ain't got no name. It's just that place, you know. You've got some real fun craftsmanship for like a little girl. That day, her heart threw, grew three times its size. Okay, or not. She's got that Cheshire grin. Shop and stuff, and it's all cool and awesome. 